Okay, what we're going to do today is I'm going to show you how to test your thermostatic actuator on your Spica injected Alpha Male Spiders and GTVs to see if it's actually defective, uh, which will affect the cold start circuit of the car. <clears throat> what we're going to look at is the end that goes into the pump. This pin should be extended about 23 to 25 millimeters from this point right here. So we're going to measure it. See what we come up with. And this one is just about 24. We'll take a rebuilt one that we've got here. Measure it. Pretty much the same thing. And then I've got a core here that's ready for a fresh rebuild. As you can see, the pin's not actually extending at all on this one, and it measures out at roughly 19. Um, and the way to test it, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go get some hot water. I'm going to put the other end of the actuator of all three of them down in some hot water and see how far we can get those tips to extend. All right, so I'll be right back with the hot water, and we'll go from there. Okay, so I've got my hot water here. Test it doesn't have to be boiling. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it's actually coming up at about 170 degrees. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the tips of each and one of the actuators, put down in the water, and you only put the bulb end of it or the end that goes in the intake manifold. You don't want to let the other end of it get wet at all. It could damage it. We're going to let it sit there for a few minutes, and we're going to measure them. And actually, the tips are actually starting to extend on them already. And now with, with them being hot, they should be about 28 to 31. They don't extend far, but they do extend. And the one that we took out of the car, is actually a 30 so we're going to say that one's good the rebuilt one is at 28 and a half and that's within spec as you can see the core one of the cores barely sticking out that's not even sticking out as far as the other ones were when they were cold And it actually only is protruding 23 when it's hot, so we'd say that that one definitely needs a rebuild. We do offer these rebuilt now. It's international auto part number 16858. There is a core charge that goes along with it. Um, <clears throat> one thing I will I ask you to take note of on this one right here. This is the core one that we received back. It is not actually an acceptable core. But if you look closely. You see on this bulb where someone's actually pinched it with a pair of pliers, that's compromised actually what the volume of that bulb will actually hold now. And the gentleman that rebuilds, this, rebuilds the actuaries for us will not rebuild one like that and guarantee it. So we don't accept them back that way.